So you might be in a situation where you want to go ahead and increase your screen timeout on your particular iPhone. Now, what does this mean? Well, basically on your particular iPhone, you might be seeing that your screen just dies out randomly fast all the time, and you might be wanting to stop that. So to do that, what you're going to want to do is you want to make your way over to your iPhone settings application just like this. And what you want to do when you're in this type of panel is you don't want to go into screen time. A lot of people go into screen time. That's not right. You want to scroll down until you see display and brightness, which is right here. So tap into display and brightness, and this next page is going to come up. Now, what you want to do here is you want to scroll down until you see a little option that says screen lock or like auto lock, one of these types of things. So auto lock and screen lock and screen on time, whatever, not screen on time, but screen, you know, lock time are all the same thing. So what you want to do is find the auto lock option and you want to tap on it. Then you come into it on this page. What you want to do is you want to click on the very, you can scroll through and decide what you want to do, but you can turn the auto, you can turn the auto lock on or off depending on what you want to do. So you can turn it from 30 seconds to one minute to two minutes, to three minutes, all the way up to never. If you never want your display to turn off, you can just tap on never and have it not turn off that way. For the average person out there though, I probably would not recommend doing that because that will basically turn your iPhone, it will never turn it off. It will just always be on until it dies out. I don't know if that's what you want to do. I do think for the average person, keeping it like two minutes or less is probably perfectly fine for you, but keeping it never is probably another thing you can do too. So those are just a couple of different options that you have, but that is basically how you do it. You go into your iPhone settings, you go inside of display and brightness and under auto lock, that's where you can kind of, you know, kind of configure it a little bit further. So that pretty much covers it up there. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, till then.